Today I lined my flower baskets. Stay tuned and I'll show you how I did it. I'm going to show you how I uh, line my baskets. I don't use the cocoa fiber anymore. They're kind of boring to me. So I like, I like color. I like different styles. So I'll show you how I line my flower baskets. Okay, for this first one, I'm going to use, this is a shopping bag. I got it for a dollar. And I'm going to cut it to fit my basket. It's made out of almost like a tight woven burlap material. So the water will drain through this. If you use like a plastic, then you'll have to put holes for drainage. But so I'll cut this to fit and I'll, I'll show you what I did. Okay, I cut the handles off and I turned the bag inside out. So what I'm going to do is cut along. There's two seams, one on each side of the, ba uh, the ba bag. I'm going to cut off one seam all the way from top to bottom, just one seam. Okay, I cut the basket, uh, the bag, and laid it in my basket. This covers one half of the basket. So I safety pinned it, pulled it tight, so by cutting that one seam I was able to lay it down into the basket and pin the sides. So I'll cut another one for the other half of the basket. So here we go. I put the second half in. I have some clothes pins to hold the edge when I put the dirt in. And then where the seams were, I hot glued it from the outside. And I hot glued some of the bottom just to take up some of that slack. So you can see the seam right there. I just turned it over and hot glued it. Same on the other side. Just turned it over and hot glued it. So now we'll get some dirt in there. So here we go. It was just that easy. Filled it with dirt, took the clothespins off, ready to plant. Here's another basket that I did. Same concept. These are two shopping bags. One seam is cut and it's set down in there and the other bag is set on the other half. And then you can see where I hot glued it, the seam. Close pin the top until you get the dirt in and it's ready for planting. Now with all my baskets, I like to use something to hold moisture. Okay, so, because in baskets they seem to dry out so quickly. So this is a, a puppy pad and it will hold moisture and help the plants. And I also put some felt underlayment. It's what goes under carpet. That I use a lot. That holds the moisture and it lasts year after year. But the puppy pads will only last one year. You can also use baby diapers, adult diapers. It helps hold the moisture. Okay, this is underlayment felt. Comes in a big roll. And this is what I'm using. Now she's ready to go. You can use these bags for all sorts of baskets. This is a bicycle basket, but I use it to hang on my fence. 
is it has hooks on it. Hangs right on my fence. And I got these baskets at the dollar store. Or the bag, tote bags I got at the dollar store. Thank you.